Accept the Codex of Ra from Zuen at 6646. Travel southwest in the Vale of Eternal Blossoms to the ruins of Gulai at coordinates 2227. Enter the Gulai Halls and follow the passageway down. Few mortals know the history of High Keeper Ra, his mastery over the elemental planes, and his relation to the Mogu Empire. If you seek to wield the weapons of a Storm Lord, venture within and learn of his deeds and his unmaking. Travel north to 5650, defeating 8 Mogu while on this quest. Stay on the squares which have the three green arrows on them where possible, continuing on toward the ancient Gulai door. Click the ancient Kulai door and enter the Hall of the Serpent. Watch off the large stone statue's cone-shaped attack as you enter this chamber and future rooms. Head down the stairs and travel south to 5647. Defeat Thunder Serpent Nalara. Loot the Edict of the Storm from its corpse. In ages long past, before the era of the mortal races, High Keeper Ra reigned over Southern Kalimdor. The Titan Amanthul bestowed upon the High Keeper a fist of light, a claw forged in the heavens 
that spoke the language of storms and placed the power of lightning within Ra's clenched fist. Leave the chamber traveling northeast and follow the passage back to the initial chamber located at 5459. Travel west to coordinates 2844. Turn north and head to 3321. Turn to the east and go down the stairs to the Gulai Vault. Click on a defeat shoe at 4729. Collect the Edict of Stone from Chu's corpse. When it came time to war against the Black Empire, Highkeeper Ra created an army of stone to do his bidding. These creatures were called the Mogu, and they called their god Ra Den, or Master Ra. The Mogu proved. Leave the chamber traveling west and follow the passage back to the initial chamber at 5459. The curse of flesh, and led by Lei Shen, the Thunder King, the High Keeper, was overthrown. Continue east to coordinates 6567, entering the Gulai Ritual Chamber. Turn north, proceeding to 7948. Defeat Xiaolang. Loot the Edict of Fire from its corpse. 
Together with the Titan Forge sorceress Helia, High Keeper Ra. Exit the chamber, traveling southwest to 5167. Prison, the wayward elemental lords. He embedded the key to these realms into his shield, the High Keeper's Ward. Ra walked among the elemental planes as both their jailer and master. Shaman, the Thunder King took up the weapons of Ra Day. Continue up the stairs to 4782. Them. Lei Shen could match the High Keeper's storm and fury, but not his mastery over the elements themselves. Perhaps you have that power. Turn the quest to Rhaegar Earth Fury. The arena is a true test of character. No one fights alone. 